Alright, so the first thing we're going to uh, we're gonna do is that we're going to show you what to do with your focus tree. So the first thing you want to do in the meta game is that you want to expand the air force. That's going to be your first exact focus. Alright, your second focus will be local development. Alright, next focus you're going to take is air superiority. Now the next focus you're going to do is you want to do this, which will then allow you to research fighter twos at a very fast rate, which do you give to Germany. The next focus you will take will be Institute Aerial Dictatorship. Alright, the next focus you want to take will be Revise the Constitution. The next focus you will take will be to get a research slide. The next focus you will do will be Flexible for flexible foreign policy. The next focus you're going to do is you're going to appoint pro-axis government. Now your next focus that you're going to do is you're going to do the Iron Guard. The next focus we're going to take is force abdication, which will get rid of King Kiro's lifestyle. Now, preserve Greater Romania. Alright, now the next focus you're going to do is you're going to do civil works. Okay. Next focus you're gonna do, and we see the whole bunch of your focuses, is you're gonna continue down the industrial focus train. All right. Next focus is going to be the Nubian Transport Network, which gives you three states with one more infrastructure. All right. Next focus we're gonna take will be Maloxa. All right. Next focus we'll do with the Steelworks for two saves and twelve steel. Alright, next focus we're going to take will be invest in the IAR, which gives us two military factories. Alright, next focus we will take is going to be that expand Palesti oil production. Okay, so next focus we're going to take is going to be expand the, the University of Bucharest. Alright, so the next focus we're going to take is not going to be equipped with the mines because this is it's extremely useless. You never research that. Next focus you're going to take is going to be a trade, trade treaty with Germany. Right. Next focus we're going to take is going to be invite German investors. Alright. The next focus we're going to do. We're only going to do a few more focuses. We're going to do, I'm going to show you two more focuses. Alright, now, the next focus that you will do, now that you're, that you're going to access, and the final fo important focus that you will do, is German-Romanian oil, it's more in oil, and this is the last focus you will take. So this is where I'm going to cut off for this sector, and now the next sector that you'll be going on to is going to be research. Alright, so now that we're on the research, my first recommendation is take this with a grain of salt. Like, some of this is going to be very important to research, but also the order won't be extremely important. So first thing we're going to research is electronic mechanical engineering, machine tools, and fighter ones. The next thing we're going to research is going to be mechanical computing for Our next thing we're going to research will be dispersed industry. Next, we're not going to research the next plane, but we're going to go over to industry and research construction. Now the next thing we're going to research is going to be radio, and now the next thing over here we're going to research is going to be transport ships. Not the transport ships, this. Uh, the next thing you're going to research is going to be fighter twos. Uh, okay, so the next thing you want to research, this is kind of really, doesn't really matter too much. You don't need to research anything else on the Navy, you can just ignore the entire Navy types. It's going to be your dog shirt. Now the radio is done, we're going to go over to the infantry equipment, and we're going to reach to Marines. Now with your new research slot, you want to go back over to industry, and you want to disperse the research to space industry. Okay. So now you finish fighter 2s, we're going to go over to industry as well, 
two hands during research construction. Alright. So you might you're gonna wanna continue down your dock. And then with the Marines, you wanna go over and research reconnaissance. Alright, and they say you're gonna research. Uh, it doesn't really matter at this point what you really research. You can kinda go on your own. Like, it's not gonna make a difference if you research artillery or you research support weapons. But for now, we're gonna do support weapons. Now, if you finished uh, reconnaissance, you're gonna research logistics company. Alright, now that we've finished machine tools, we're gonna go over and re research computing machine. Alright, and now that we've finished that, we're gonna research and improve infantry equipment. Alright, now that logistics is done. You're gonna go over to artillery, and you're gonna research interwar artillery. All right, and basically once you finish that, just continue down your doctrine again. All right, now that your guns are done, you're gonna go over to support weapons too. Now that you finish computing machine, you're gonna want to research. It, it really doesn't matter right now, but you can either do for special forces, or I'd recommend rushing disperse three. That's what I'm gonna do. Now that we finished artillery, it's we're just gonna rush um, construction, or we're gonna actually research construction, and then we're gonna go oil. Next, we're gonna go over to oil. All right. So now that that's done, we're gonna research. We're gonna go over to industry and research fuel silo. Now that I disperse, disperse, disperse three is done. We're gonna research artillery too. Fuel's done, we're gonna go to fuel fighting one. And once construction finishes, we're gonna research the next level of events. Alright, once you finish artillery, you're gonna go back over to your industry and your research advanced machine. So now that you have just you finish guns. There's really not a whole lot of research right now, but what I'll go for is an anti-air upgrade. Or actually you always want to keep your support companies updated, so we'll just start upgrading your support companies. Alright, the next focus we're going to take, or what you're saying, is just getting it done on fuel refinement. We just want to buff how much fuel we get. Now, your next slot of research you want to do is, is this going to be worth to rush a pre competing machine for that extra research speed? Uh, next, you're gonna just basically continue to support companies and do recon. Alright, now that recon's 2, we're gonna do logistics 2. Alright, now this is gonna be like the second to last thing I'm gonna show you, but fuel findings for the reason I'm gonna It's just keep grinding out that fuel. And then, <clears throat> once you finish this focus, that's gonna be the last thing, which I'm just gonna continue down the doctrine. But, basically, what you're gonna wanna do is that when this finishes you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna start researching excavation tools all of these and then also you wanna go back to your military and upgrade these and then on the side uh research special forces so what I would do or what yeah what I would do is that I'd research excavation for your next few research slots or the next two and then two after that, I go both of these tools. And then the next one, I go special forces. And then your research really just won't matter. You're, you're just gonna continue down, continue down your line doctrine, upgrade your, keep upgrading your artillery, keep adding your support equipment, engineering, and industry. Besides that, there's really not a whole lot left to the Romanian uh, doctrine. 
And next, the next country that you're going to be going on to is going to be political. Alright guys, now that we're on to the political section, I'm just going to basically just cheat in political power. And I'm just going to show you what you're going to do with the political power you get. So, and what order. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get a silent workhorse. And then once you get your silent workhorse, you're going to get, you're going to go for partial mob. And then once you get that, you're gonna, next the next 150, you're gonna do, get, do free trade. And then next, you're gonna do the background backstabber. And then after that guy, you're gonna hire a military theorist. Then you're gonna hire a captain of industry. And then you're gonna hire an industrial concern. And then infantry designer. And then you're gonna probably wanna do your manpower. And once you do that, you can just hire your infantry, this guy. You only hire those two guys, because they're useless. Also, you're gonna wanna hire not a plain guy or an EP guy, but your army offense. And that's everything there, which will set you back to a lot of political power. And then if you want, if you have the extra political power, or you just want to mix it up, you can get higher stability, because there's no, there's no focuses that give you more stability. So the only way to get more stability is just through decisions. And that's literally all for political. And the next thing I'm going to show you is uh, what to do for the economic. Alright, so now that we're on to uh, economic. Basically, all, this is the most simple part. But basically, you want to build cities and these provinces in Bukovina. But do not build anything in Basarabia. Do not. And because because uh, Russia's going to take it. And after the game goes on, you're going to want to build... Factory, civilian factories until I'd say the middle of 38 so I would say June of 38 and then after that I would come to start start building mills and all the new factories you have and the new building plots you have and that's really all for the video you're not going to be doing anything with planes or anything with your navy and you're going to get a strong military and basically just be a very strong supportive minor nation I hope you guys enjoyed this video and just got a lot of information out of it. A like would be very much appreciated, and even though that sounds like a really shitty question, but it would, it would help a lot with starting out this channel. So I'll thank you all.